everybody, happy Monday to you. My name is Steve, welcome to another outstanding episode of the Steve Tendo Show. Episode 274 on the program. Tonight! <clears throat> Excuse me, let me try that again. Tonight! Yeah, that's fine. On the program, uh, we're starting a Pokemon Leaf Green playthrough. Um, I've played, I believe I said I played Sapphire, Emerald, and Blue on the Steve Tendo show, but I've not played Leaf Green, and I don't think I've ever actually done everything in a Leaf Green Fire Red playthrough. But before we go, let's just throw the old Shack Pets advertisement up there. Let's see if it'll work on the first one. I'm sure it will not. So don't do the first one, we'll do the second one. If you're new to the channel, make sure to give us a follow. If you want to subscribe? We'd love that too. So, if you missed last week's episodes, uh, I'm streaming without a webcam. I have it connected and everything. I'm just trying something a little different for the next couple of weeks. This is my grandson. He's been your ride or since you were both babyish. What is his name again? As we always do in a Pokemon game, uh, I will name the rival after my brother, Jimmy. As always. I remember now. His name was Jimmy. God, I hate that kid. Steve, your very own Pokemon Legends is about to unfold. A world of dreams and adventures with Pokemon await. Let's go! Okay. Uh, so I'm gonna try to use Pokemon that I don't normally use in a Gen 1 playthrough. Uh, I'm probably still gonna pick Squirtle, because, you know, have to pick Squirtle for these. Hey, Ma! Right, our boys leave home someday. It said so on TV. Oh, yeah, Professor. Professor Oak! Next door, I was looking for you. Okay, bye, Mom. Still don't have my running shoes. Yeah, you don't get that. Hey! Don't go out there. Maverick! Steve Red, Steve Green. The Sun Chief! Where would Pokemon live in tall grass? You need your own Pokemon for your own protection. I know. Yeah, let's go to back to my lab. Can't see, but I'm dancing right now. Gramps? I'm fed up waiting. Oh yeah, Jimmy? Yeah, yeah, let me think. Oh, that's right, I told you to come to... Just wait. Ha, ah, Steve. There are three Pokemon here. Ha! No, you idiot, they're on the table. When I was young, I was a serious Pokemon trainer. But now, in my old age, I have only three left. You can have one. Well, that was weird, I like, flashed there for a second. Hey, Gramps! No fair! What about me? Shut up, Jimmy. You can have one, too. 
No, I do not want Bulbasaur. Okay, Squirtle's in the middle. This Pokemon's really quite energetic. And he's the best! Uh, yeah, we'll name him. I, this is not gonna be a Nuzlocke. Uh, this is just gonna be a routine playthrough. Uh, but we'll name him if Chichuki will fit. Oh, we stand Sturtle. We stand Squirtle all day. Oops, Steve. Uh, Steve T N. Oh, Steve Tendo would fit there. Eh, not Chichuki it is. I'll take this one. I may have to speed up the text. Let me see. Text speed mid. Get yeah, fast. Bouncing on shift. Mono help. Frame. Frame one. Two. Wait, Steve, let's check out our Pokemon. Come on, I'll take you on. Oh, yeah? I'll kick your ass, Jimmy. Oh, for Pete's sake. So pushy as always. Steve, you've never had a Pokemon battle before, have you? Not that I know of, Professor. Your Pokemon battles when traders put their Pokemon against each other. Trainer makes other Pokemon try to faint by lowering their HP zero wins. But rather than talking about it, get your ass out there and do it. Alright, Professor, thank you. I know you have to treat me like I've never played the game before, but, you know. Jimmy won our first battle. Player defeated rival Jimmy. What? Unbelievable! Unbelievable! I picked the wrong Pokemon. If you win, you'll earn prize money and your Pokemon will grow. Battle other trainers and make your Pokemon strong. Okay, Professor. Alright, I'll make my Pokemon battle toughen it up. Steve, Gramps, smell you later. Now what, Professor? I think I need to come back with the, uh, parcel first, so then they'll give me Pokeballs. Mom! Steve, take a quick rest. Okay. Smell you later to Gary. Ash was here. Gary was here. Ash is a loser. Warning, there's a different save file. Yes, I know. I did this earlier. And that's what happens when you hit no. So what I might end up doing is I might try and play all the games if I can get them to work on my on my uh, YouTube and Twitch channel, but I, that, I don't know yet. Alright, so let's go see what we can find. So we're gonna try and use Pokemon that we don't normally use for these playthroughs. But right now I don't have any Pokeballs, so... Hi, we're in a Pokemon Mart. It's part of a convenient chain selling all sorts of things. Please visit a Viridian City. I know, I'll give you a sample. Here you go. Obtain the potion. Thanks, bro.
See those ledges along the road? It's a bit scary, but you can jump from them. You can get back to Pallet Town. Okay. I haven't used a Pidgey in a long time. Eh, we'll see. Maybe I'll just catch Pokemon that I like. And I'll name them after people watching. So right now it's just Maverick. That would be embarrassing. Alright. Bubble? Yeah, there we go. Da to do. So I played pretty much all of this game except the there's additional islands later on that I don't think I've done anything at. And that's after, I think, uh, Cinnabar Island. So that's way into the game. Thank God they don't charge money. Glad they didn't start doing that. Town, right? You know Professor Oak, right? His order came in. Can I get you to take it to him? Sure. A lazy bastard shopkeep. Alright, so I still don't have any Pokeballs, so I can't catch anything yet. Ah! Yeah. Is she saying that, or is he saying that? Grandpa, don't be so mean. I'm so sorry. He hasn't had his coffee yet. Or he's shit-faced. I absolutely forbid you from going through here. This is private property. I think there's videos all over the internet saying that the translation was supposed to be the he's. That animal man is drunk. Instead of being exhausted from not having caffeine. Alright, so let's go bring the uh, package back to Prof Oak. Can always use some experience, so. Uh, so I'm not sure what I'm playing tomorrow and Wednesday. Um, I'm might be starting a Mario World playthrough on the channel and a, a Link to the Past playthrough again on the, play, on the channel, so you never know. Just gotta pop in and see. Check it and see. Spit in that rat's face. Oh, this is going to be interesting. I'm not going to be able to experience share them yet. So whatever I catch early on, I'm going to have to... I'm going to have to stop. Switch trend. Sorry, I blanked on the words. Oh, Steve, how's my old Pokemon doing? Well, seems to be growing more attached to you. You must be talented as a Pokemon shirt. Tell me something I don't know, Professor. What's that? You have something for me? I delivered Oak's parcel. Ah, 
that's the custom Pokeball I ordered. I had it, uh, it, I had it on order. Thank you. Gramps! I almost forgot. Uh, what'd you call me for? Alright, a request for you two. On the desk there is my invention, the Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen a caught. I am not completing the Pokedex. Don't ask. So hi, check Encyclopedia. Steve and Jimmy, take these with you. Steve received the Pokedex. You can't get detailed data on Pokemon by just seeing them. You must catch them to obtain complete data. So, here are some tools for catching those wild Pokemon. Steve received Pokeballs. Steve put the Pokeballs in the ballpark. When a wild Pokemon appears, it's fair game. Just throw a Pokeball at it and try to catch it. This won't always work, however. A healthy Pokemon can escape, so you'll have to be lucky to make a complete guide on all the Pokemon in the world. That was my dream. But I'm too old now. Ah, I can't get the job done. So I want you two to fulfill my dream for me. Get moving. I hate you two. I mean, I love you two. This is a great undertaking in Pokemon history. All right, Gramps. Leave it all to me. Steve, fuck you. I don't need you. <laughs> I borrow a town map for my sister. Tell her not to let you one. Ha <laughs> ha! Don't bother coming around to my place. Why am I friends with him? Why? Why do you tolerate that? I. I don't really know. It's like shit. Why do I hang out with that guy? Such a, such a douche. Professor Oak may not look like much, but he's the authority on Pokemon. You got that right, lady. Alright, now I think I can go my to my house. At some point, they're gonna give me the running shoes. Oh, I don't get the running shoes, too. Till after Brock. Oh shit, that's right. Alright, let's go get a map. Grandpa asked you to run an errand? Gee, that's lazy of him. Here, this'll help you. Thanks, Daisy. Daisy Oak. You can use the town map to find where you are. Look, just because we're leaving, doesn't mean there's no tension between us. I know you love me. I gotta go! Alright, so now let's see what our first Pokemon will be. I have one or two in mind. If I can get the one, I think I can. I'm not sure if I'm gonna catch Pidgey or Rattata. go see if we can catch something. Oops, sorry. Wrong direction. I'm not gonna fight the rival yet. We are not ready. Well, that's what I wanted. Nice, you're gonna try and catch me a nice pig monkey. Chuck him if you got him. I will name him Maverick the monkey. 
extremely quick to anger, it could be docile one moment, then thrashing away the next instant. Maverick, the Mankey. Welcome aboard! So basically, they make the first... I mean, if you take Charmander, really the only way you're gonna beat Brock is if you get if you get that Mankey. Or, if you level up your Charmander to learn Metal Claw. Let me see what... A... Vital Spirit prevents sleep. Scratch and Leer. Alright, so it's not, it's not great yet. I can find a Nidoran female. I don't use a Nidal Queen very often. Should be able to survive one. Nope, oh, won't be able to survive one more after that. joys of Gen 1 leveling up early. Fire red and leaf green. I'm running having a good Monday night. Thanks for spending part of it with the Nintendo Show. Hey, Maverick, you're level three. Did you learn anything? Pokey Steve Show! Pokey Steve Show! Should get one more off here. Well, not after that. Survive one scratch. I thought I could, and I did. I'm gonna refresh chat real quick. Just real fast. One thing I wish they did much earlier was give you experience when you caught Pokemon. But they didn't start that until I think Gen 6, I think.
Hey, all right. Still didn't learn a move yet. Let's try and get him at the level five before we go heal him. I doubt he can survive a front one of four. We'll see how much they do to Squirtle. Spit on that monkey. Spit on the monkey, don't spit the monkey. Do do da da do. Heal after this fight, because I don't think Squirrel can last another attack, another battle. Oh, he might be able to. Oh, I missed! It's not a Nuzlocke, so even if anybody dies, who cares? Just a good old fun playthrough. Free resurrection for days? That's how it should be. Pay, here's your five bucks. And we bring your uh, pet back to back from the depths of hell. Or you know, just death, you know, like Depending on, uh, no harm, no foul. Uh, 12. Okay. I don't know if I'm going to catch Pikachu in the forest. I kind of have a different electric type in mind. for the playthrough if I can get it. Alright, so Mankey Maverick is finally starting to show some fight on his own now. attack, though. How do you not learn attack yet, Mankey? You're stronger than another Mankey. You are stronger than another Mankey. Bow before me. Let's see you handle this one. There can be only one Maverick. The strongest of the Mankeys. There can be only one! Oh, that's, that's good experience for that. I'm wondering if you just can't find Nidoran female here.
No Rattata. Level 5 Rattata. I was tempted, but I don't know if he'll survive that. Maverick the Maverick. I meant to say Maverick the Mangy. I said Maverick the Maverick. Hi, SpongeBob. SpongeBob. All right. Learn an attack, please. Finally. Mankey doesn't learn low kick until level six. A lot of make fighting the Rattatas easier. Can't believe I said that. Making the ma the Rattatas easier to fight. I have a rival fight coming up right like three feet from where we are now. Uh, so that's why I'm trying to grind the levels quickly. I'm guessing you just can't find Nidoran female here. It's been a while since I've played this one, so... If I can get him up to level 8, I should be able to handle the rival fight. Hey, Spiro. I haven't used... Hey, you know what? I haven't used Spiro in a long time. Oh, well, catch him anyway. in grassy areas. It has to flap its short wings at high speed to stay airborne. Oh, whoops. Well, I guess I'm not using them then. I can nickname them later. He was going to be Kyle, the, the Spiro, but then I forgot to nickname him. That's a one hit crit. And eh, maybe not one hit crit, but it was one hit. That's all I care about. Still not one hitting these Rattatas.
I think he'll have a, a Bulbasaur and a Pidgey. I think for the rival fight. I think. Kick him in the face. Oh, that was a one hit. Super effective. Okay, one more. We'll get him to level eight. Then we'll move on, fight the rival, then make our way into the Viridian Forest. See if we can find anything cute. either a 9 and a 7. See if we can find, after we fight them, we'll see if we can find anything bug-wise in the forest. Like a Weedle. Usually go with Caterpie, but I'll try and see if I can find a Weedle. Oops, wrong one. Meant to hit the save. Just do you? God won't let you through without him. By the way, did your Pokemon get any stronger? Did yours? Hey, oh, oh, hey, oh. Oh, I thought he was starting with the. I thought he was gonna start with the Bulbasaur. Why did I did not do anything? Stop sand attacking me, you stupid bird. I think he sand attacked me like six times. Pidgey. So what's the point of lowering his speed then? And I miss the turn I go first. Yes, Biro. See what you can do. If I decide to keep you around. did his job, or she did her job.
Oh, I forgot fighting is not very effective on poison. That Spiro did her job. No, oh, you just lucked out. Yeah? Go to help Jimmy. I heard the Pokemon League's crawling with tough trainers. I had to figure out how to get past them. You should quit dawdling and get a move on. Screw you, Jimmy! Alright, so Spiro actually helped. But it doesn't matter because she's dead now. Shut up, Jimmy, aka Gary. Yeah, shut up, Gary, Jimmy. Alright, so we're gonna heal. We're gonna put Spiro in the box. So we're going to buy some Pokeballs. And a couple of antidotes, because fighting in the forest is a pain in the ass. <clears throat> now, let's see. Five. Five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right. Alright, so we beat our rival, and uh, to recap, Maverick the Mankey is level 8, Chichuki the Squirtle is level 9. Oh no, I've had my coffee, and what's that I need to get going? I know how to catch Pokemon. Don't you see I have two? Weedle appeared. Old man said, The hell read it out, teach him. I think that Weedle can be shiny. I think. I think in most. If not all the games, the catching tutorial can have a shiny Pokemon. There, now tell me that was educational. Oh, the TGTV. I forgot about that thing. Yeah, I don't need to do that. Bye. Bye. Alright, let's see if we can find something good in here. Rattata. Kick him! Hey, alright! Alright, let's move into the forest. Let's see if we can find anything cool. Rattata may be small, but don't underestimate its wicked bite. Wicked, wicked bite, yo. You ball calling already? Are you going to Raven Forest? Yeah, I am. I'm in the, like, outpost. Why wouldn't I be going to Viridian Forest? I came here with some friends to catch us some bug Pokemon. They're all itching to get into some Pokemon battles. <laughs> Team Weedle, as long as I can catch you. Oh, 
often found in forests eating leaves. It has a sharp stinger on its head that injects poison. Yes, now, now we can name the bug Kyle. That thing poisons me immediately. Should probably bought a potion. Get crit. That was a one-hit crit. Shows you're paying attention. Oh, poison bug? Poison isn't super effective on bug yet anymore. Oh. I forgot about that. Come on, Kyle. Poison this worm. I should have bought an antidote while I was shopping. Eh, oh well. What are they just immune to getting poisoned here? I mean, come on. Poison him, you worm! I may end up dropping you when I get out of the Mount Moon anyway. Hey guys, is there a reason why they're not getting poisoned? fighting a Weedle. Stop spitting your sticky f juices on me! <laughs> Apparently he didn't listen. championship game while I am here. Okay. Oof. Oh good, I got poisoned. 38 to 7. That's why you buy antidotes. And 
that, boys and girls, is why you buy an antidote. Or five. Poison him, you fool! Shed skin unpoisoned him immediately. Poison him again. Alright, so the first time shed poison shed skin removed it. The second time it did not. Shabby. I stroke Pokeballs, catch Pokemon, and I ran out. That's why you can never have too many. Fortunately, Weedle is probably not gonna fight, or Kakuna, or Beedrill, or whatever it is, when uh, I fight Brock, because he will not do well. Poison him, you fool! I mean, if you're not gonna poison the bugs, then there's no point in using you. That sounds about right. Oh, hey, you're not supposed to get a crit on me. I'll have your badge for this Caterpie. running shoes until you get the first badge. Boing. <laughs> Alright, thank you, Nurse Joy. Heal me.
so I don't lose anything that I've already done. Because that would be mucho annoying. Alright, so we have two level nines, a squirrel named Chichuki, and a manky named Maverick. We're just leveling up a Weedle named Kyle. He's close to evolving. Into Kakuna. Kuna would change! Rando. First trainer battle. Hey! You got Pokemon? Come on, let's battle them! Come on, let's battle them! <laughs> Bug catcher Rick. My name's not Rick. Swap out. Uh, Maverick. No, I said Maverick. That's bullshit! That is ridiculous. I put I shoot poison sting 20 times and get one. He shoots one and gets it. with a side of shit. One. Two. My eye is twitching as we speak. <laughs> Four. Five. Six. Seven. Seven poison stings didn't get one. But we did evolve, though. Seven. What? Cow's evolving. Congratulations, your Kyle evolved into Kakuna. Kakuna learned Harden. Thank you, Kakuna. Yo! Can't jam out if you're a Pokemon trainer. Don't know what that means. Bugcatcher Doug. Oh, I thought that was Harden. Not sure why he doesn't have... Not sure why he doesn't have a Kakuna. Now it's time to play the game. Steve gets scared fighting a Weedle battle.
Son of a bitch! <laughs> what am I shooting my stinger a different angle? Of the century, Kakuna versus Kakuna. All right, I'm done screwing around with this Kakuna, even though I want my Kakuna to get all the experience. Oh, it's gonna take forever. That's the crit we wanted. if you go easy on me. Don't worry, little bug catcher boy. Bug catcher Tony. Oh, catch Tony. Send out Caterpie. You got problem with that? Send me a Caterpie. Still no poison. What am I, shooting blanks here? Using some kind of anti poison ammo or something. Come on, poison the worm. Never mind. Try it again.
there a reason why he's not getting poisoned? For any of these Pokemon that I'm fighting? Thank you. I was like, you better get that critical hit. Even though he didn't, really. It's a Pikachu! I'm gonna catch Pikachu. I have another electric type in mind. Eh, maybe I'll try and catch him. I won't use him. Pikachu! You know, for a game. No! Uh, Pikachu, what are you doing? Get in the Pokeball. Pikachu, do not make me kick you in the face. Alright then. I guess the threat of me kicking Pikachu in the face was enough to scare it to stay in the Pokeball. When several of these Pokemon gather, their electricity can build and cause lightning storms. Yeah, I got a nickname for you. A Pikachu mainstay, Chuck. Chucky the Pikachu. I was like, if that stupid worm poisoned me again. I'd stab him! what I'm gonna do real quick I don't want to die there's a trainer coming up that's kind of a pain in the ass to deal with Just in case. I don't trust that Weedle, that uh, Metapod being able to survive one attack from that thing.
when he's got three HP. Apparently 11 experience points were not enough to level up the Weedle. Kakuna. Why do I keep calling him Weedle? Maverick, go out there. You're level 9. Get out there and kick that worm in the face! Never mind. <laughs> well, that didn't do anything! Alright, level 9. One more level till a bee drill. So right now we have a water type, a fighting type, and a bug slash poison type. Um, I know of an electric type that I want. Potentially a fire type that I want. And then the last one will either be a ground type or a psychic type. Maybe. And I may know who those are too. We'll see. We'll see. Oh, and a grass type. I know what the grass type is when I can find them. Chuck, enjoy your solitude in PC box land. Two potions and two antidotes. No, not Pokeballs. Two. Bye, Chuck. He'll be fine. He'll be fine. He'll hang out with the Spiro. <laughs> and there'll be several other Pokemon in there at some point for him. man came out of like in the middle of nowhere all right so let's see we got a kyle the meta up uh, kakuna god i cannot wait for you to evolve into a beetle level nine maverick the manky level nine and squirtle the and chichuki the squirtle level 10 on the plus side we're not going to need much to beat brock so oh but i'm gonna have to catch more pokemon probably axe man more like Joking one. <laughs> oh man, you coming in hot. <laughs> coming in hot. Tokimon. He's <laughs> bespoke one. Bespoke post. Now, spit on that bug. Can't afford it. Don't ask. <laughs> Dokimon. Bespoke. I think I can afford bespoke post. I choose not to. But I'm not pretentious like that, you know, like to have, what, like, shorts and a knife delivered in the mail? Hey, finally got a poisoning! Hooray! Massive damage to me, Chuck. I'll have to kill you. Get 
kill him! Yeah, 35. That wasn't worth it. Uh, so my new mouse doesn't even have button programming software. I'm having to use auto hotkey like some caveman. Really? Doesn't have button programming? That that kind of sucks. I got a new wireless mouse so I can watch computer stuff in my bed. <laughs> Does that mean I'm lazy? No, it just means I'm an uh, uh, innovative thinker. See how much poison sting goes to a level three wheel. Not enough. There you go. Good job. I just need F12 on the fifth button for steam screenshots. Alright, that's not bad. Steamer. Steamer. Alright, that's doing some more damage now. Caterpie is illegal in most jurisdictions. That'll teach him using illegal Caterpies. Vegas fighting Caterpies. Google to see if Caterpie can be poisoned and fire red and leave green. Uh, Caterpie. Uh, fire red. Caterpie from being a hit, being hit by additional effects of moves. So I guess that does mean it can't be poisoned. What happens? Vegas stays on your record forever. Wait, wait a minute! I don't know. I didn't know that. <laughs> uh, well, that doesn't sound very good. That doesn't sound right either. Let's fight Ivan T. Bugman. Did you know that Pokemon evolve? Yep, yeah, bro, I'm a trainer after all. Bugcatcher Charlie, Ivan T. Bugman. Level 7 Metapod. Oh, well, this won't make me want to gouge my eyes out. Oh, nice, you got a first hit crit. Not the one hit crit that we want, but still. Poison! Hey, good work, Kyle. <laughs> good job, Kyle. And then do it again, but do it stronger. Hey, there's another knockout crit. Oh, that's what I like. 
Yeah, do it again, only better. Do it again, only better and stronger and faster. That's not doing it better, faster, or stronger, Kyle. Poison him, you fool! is the level of 12 and 14. We won't need that much help for that. Might be able to beat Brock right now. I might try and get some, uh, get them up to 12. Or whatever, I might just use low kick and kill them all. You can't, don't be afraid to use your nails, boys! Nice. Defeated Bug Catcher Charlie. Oh, I lost. Hey, I forgot about Kakuna evolving. Bees! Evelyn's twin needle also. Congratulations, your Kyle evolved into Beedrill. Kyle, oh, fury attack. Bees! Throw it to be tw uh, twin needle. Ups bug moves in a pinch, which he only has string shot. Great. Wonderful. Wonderful. Got ups ability. The ups bug moves. You have no bug moves. Xanadu. Pokemon, I think. Hey, I found a potion. Hot diggity dog. Uh, okay, so let's save first. God forbid something happens. I 
that guy. That guy! Oof. Wow. Man, Georgia is killing TCU in this college football championship game. 52-7. to seven. Damn it! Get screwed again. Hey, wait up. What's the hurry? Why the rush? Because I want to get out of this forest. It's full of bugs, man. One Pokemon bug catcher, Sammy. Send out a Weedle. Level 9 Weedle. Spit on him! Alright, do not get poisoned, please. Thank you. Spit on him again! No one want to get stinged by bees, man. Yeah, nobody wants to get stinged by bees. Stung or sting by them their bees. Nobody likes those them their bees. I think even if the Pokemon world was real, I don't know if I'd want to raise a bee that I could be like that I'd have to console and touch and stuff. Like no way, bee drill, get out of here. Ninety-nine, nice level eleven. Defeated Bug Catcher Sammy. I am good at this, Sammy. Maybe you're just the one who's bad. I know there's hidden items in here. There, I was like, why did he die? He didn't attack. I did. And like, or I didn't attack him. He did. And I was like, no, you attacked him. I know there's a hidden item in there somewhere, but I don't feel like sifting for an hour to find it, so... Should probably be using Beedrill for this part.
Because <laughs> okay, I'm not using B drill in the gym battle. All right, that's a one-hit crit. Oh yeah. Everybody loved the one-hit crits. you can find stuff on the ground. I'm looking for the stuff I dropped. Can you find them? Can you can you help me? I can you help can you help this old bug catcher find his keys or whatever I dropped? Can you help me? Oh that's it, you're dead. Damn it, I know there's stuff here. Uh, so for tomorrow and Wednesday, I'm leaning toward Mario Super Mario World tomorrow and Link to the Past on Wednesday. I think that's gonna be our schedule for a little while. I also wanna splash something in, I don't know. Hey, alright. Hey, finally learned a new move. is great chop foes attacked with a sharp chop it has a high critical hit ratio oh yeah hope you guys enjoyed that asmr butt pushing I can be cut down. I hear. Many Pokemon only live in the forest. You need to be persistent and look everywhere. Do you know the evolution cancel technique? When a Pokemon's evolving, you can stop the process. It's a technique for raising Pokemon the way they were. Or are, whatever, you know. I'm not the judge of reading. Push the B button. And then you're supposed to be like, What the hell's the B button? Wowie, zowie! Actually, I may let Kyle fight the trainer in the in Brock's gym. fight the trainer in the gym because I think he's just got a diglet and a sand shrew. Come on, damn it, Kyle. You can't get three hits on this thing. Alright, let's go up. 
Let's go to the Pewter City. Trainer tips. All Pokemon that appear in battle have a briefly earned experience. Who's this guy? And I'm many serious Pokemon trainers here. They're all like bug catchers, you know, just hobbyists. But Pewter Jim's Brock isn't like that. Not one bit. Thank you. Pokemon learn new techniques as they grow. As I moves must be taught to them by people. Pokemon becomes easier to catch if it's got a status problem. Yo, I can't peril. I can't poison things, kid. I'm gonna heal first, then we'll talk to all these people. First up, kid with Jigglypuff. <sighs> when Jigglypuff sings, Pokemon get drowsy. Me too. <laughs> poo, poo, poo. Go to bed. Hi, glad to meet you. That's unfriendly. You're not saying hi back. So come on, tell me about yourself. Profile is written using four words or phrases. There's plenty of words to choose from. Oh, I forgot about that. Uh, yeah. Yeah, go to hell. I'm training Pokemon that kid over there. I had two Pikachu, so I figured I might as well trade one. Dude, you're getting a Pikachu? I really want a Pikachu, so I'm trading my Clefairy for one. That's a good trade for that guy. What? Hey, Rocket, is that Mount Moon? Huh? I'm on the phone. Get the hell away from me. Hey, dude, you're in the public area. Fuck you. I taught that guy. Taught, taught that guy talking on the phone that I did. Psst, you know what I'm doing. Sure. That's right. It's hard work. Hey, you know what I'm doing? Spraying repel to keep wild Pokemon out of my garden. Dude, this is like a communal garden. You, you have... A whole garden? Uh, let's see here. Uh, no, I don't want to talk to that kid yet. Did you check out the... No? Oh. I didn't talk to the kid at the at outskirts of town. Because I didn't want to go to the museum. Share the garden? Shake my head. It's like a, it's like a town garden, but it's pretty big. Ba, ba, ba. There's the museum. We will go in there at some point. But I'm not ready to go in there yet. Nidoran, sit! Good Nidoran. Sit, Ubu. Good boy. Our Pokemon's an outsider, so it's finicky and hard, hard to handle now. Yes, around. Bow, bow, bow. An outsider's a Pokemon that you get in a trade. It grows fast, but it may be an asshole and ignore your trades stuff. What was that? Sorry, I heard something outside. I heard something near me, and I was like, what was that noise? Like, it was nothing. Alright, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna buy a couple of potions. I'm gonna see if what else I can buy. Okay, I have seven Pokeballs. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna just buy one. Because I'm because I'm low on the monies. I don't usually spend all my money that quickly, but here we are. All right, let's talk to this kid. This kid's gonna be like, hey man, you're a trainer, right? Rats looking for new challengers, follow me. Man, two people being jerks telling me which way to go. Buy money. Yeah, buy money is right. I wonder what that girl says. You have the right stuff. Go pick up rock. Okay.
Clefairy came from the moon. That's what the rumor is. They appear after moonstones fell on that moon. Okay. Time to fight Brock. Fuck this guy. Hey, yo! You want to dream big? Do you dare to dream of becoming a Pokemon champ? I'm no trainer, but I can advise you on how to win. Let me take you to the top. Alright, let's get happening. First Pokemon out in the match is at the left. Okay, thanks, champ. That's it? That's all you're gonna tell me? Alright, let's see if we can do this. Stop right there, kid! You're 10,000 light years from facing Brock. Camper Liam wants to battle. Geo, dude! I thought he had a. I thought he had a Sandshrew! Fuck. I could have sworn he had a sand shrew and a diglet. I got bamboozled! Oh, because he defensive curled. Oh man. Well I'll just I'll just switch him out and kill him anyway. But I wanted B drill to get experience for this. There's the Sand Shrew that I thought he was leading off with. Wow, that uh, did really no damage. Damn it, Kyle! Give me some five hits here! Oh! There we go, that's what I want. 219? Uh, yes, please. Darn! Light years is in time, it measures distance. You're pretty hot, but not as hot as Brock. I don't know, I am pretty hot. Psst. Brock, I will be right with you. I just want to heal my bee drill. God forbid I have to use them. High and hot. That's right. Gotta think like the best to be the best. <laughs> there, let me just save again. Be so that trainer battle is done inside Brock's gym. 65 to 7. Holy shit balls, Batman. I did not think that college football game. I did not think TCU was not going to put up that much of an effort. Whew. Well, I guess they think they're going to get bulldozed early. All right. Um, let's see. Geodude should be first. I think this is how they make it so you can, if you're playing Pokemon Yellow, when you start with Pikachu, they put a Mankey over where we got him. And Nidoran had Double Kick, which is a fighting move. So that's an easy way of beating Brock. Hey, so you're here! I'm Brock! I'm 
version of this gym leader. My rock hard willpower is evident, even in my Pokemon. My Pokemon are all rock hard and have true grit determination. That's right, my Pokemon are all the rock type. <laughs> You're gonna challenge me knowing that you'll lose? That's the trainer's honor that compels you to challenge me. Fine then, show me your best. One second, Brock, I need a drink. Leader Brock! I like the battle! Leader Brock! So do you, dude. Super effective! Geodude fainted! No, Maverick, I'm gonna let you see if you can sweep the round. Oh, I should've used Low Kick. Low Kick is better the heavier the opponent is, I think. Shabam! That's a crit. That's the match. Player defeated Looter Brock. I took you for granted, and so I lost. As proof of your victory, I confer on you this the official Pokemon League Boulder Badge. Steve received the Boulder Badge from Brock. Yahoo! <laughs> Thus, having the Boulder Badge makes your Pokemon more powerful. It also enables the use of the move Flash outside of battle. E a Z. Of course, a Pokemon must know the move Flash to use it. I got 1400 bucks. Man, it'd be nice to be like a, like a... I guess you're getting paid kind of like the professional cockfight. And, or dogfighter, and they get like 1500 bucks. I'd be like, it'd be nice to just have your job be like, show up for 10 minutes and earn $1,500. Wait! Take this with you. TM39 from Brock. A TM, or technical machine, contains a technique for Pokemon. Using a technique, using a TM te teaches the move it contains to a Pokemon. A TM is good for one use only. It wasn't like that in Gen 8, and then went back to that in Gen 9. Actually, they were technical records in Gen 8. Rock Tomb. There are all kinds of trainers in this huge world of ours. You appear to be a very gifted as Pokemon trainer. Thank you, Brock. So let me make a suggestion. Hit on every girl you see. I mean, sorry, that's Brock's method. Go to the gym in Cerulean and test your abilities. I wonder who these pictures are on the wall. Alright, so one gym badge down. Seven to go. So as of now, our team is... Maverick the Mankey, level 12. Squirtle the Chichuki, level 12. Or excuse me, Chichuki the Squirtle. And then Kyle the Beedrill, level 11. I didn't think... I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to sweep that with the uh, Mankey. But I did. I'm going to go heal, just in case. I don't remember if there's any fights in the, the museum. Oh, I should go get my running shoes from that dweeb outside of town. I think what we're gonna do, uh, I'm gonna try and get through um, the path to Mount Moon and possibly Mount Moon uh, before I call tonight's episode. So that next time we can do Nugget Bridge, the path to Bill, and Misty. Oh, there he is. Oh, Steve, I'm glad I caught up with you. I'm ah, Professor Oak's aid. I'm gonna ask the deliverance to you, so here you go. I received the running shoes. Steve received the running shoes from the aid. Steve switched shoes with the running shoes. Man, how would you like to be this scientist who your associate is like the main authority on anything in the world, and then you're tasked with, oh yeah, by the way, bring this kid his shoes that he forgot at the office, and then switch them out and bring his old shoes back to his house.
There's a letter attached. Oh, it's from my mommy. Dear Steve, here's a pair of running shoes for my beloved challenger. Oh, thank you, Mom. Remember, I'll always cheer for you. Don't ever give up. From Mom. Could have said love, but you know. Granted, she wouldn't let me meet my father, so you know. <laughs> Yes, yes, it's fifty dollars for a child's chicken. And this better be the best museum in the world, man. Thanks, Mom. <laughs> I should be grateful for my long life. Never did I think we'd get to see the bones of a dragon. It's not really a dragon, it's a dinosaur. Kabutops. Daddy, daddy! Oh, I should have talked to her for- Daddy, I want a Pikachu, it's so cute! That's my daddy, catch me one. He's a- he's kind of a flank, but, uh... Yes, dear Pikachu soon, I promise. Now let's look at the Challenger. Actually, I don't know if that is the Challenger. That might be the Apollo. This month, we're running a space exhibit. Alright, I thought there'd be more pomp and circumstance from that, but okay. Moonstone, huh? What's so special about it? It's like an ordinary rock to me. Palestine. July 20th, 1969. Humankind first set foot on the moon that day. I bought a color TV just so I could watch that news. Also in 1969, my beloved New York Jets won the Super Bowl. Hasn't happened since, but I bought a color TV for that. Oh, thanks, man. Ah. <laughs> a meteorite that fell on that moon. I think that was 1969. Not worth 50 bucks to go into the museum, that's for sure. I got fucking hosed. Am I, he am I healed for this? Yeah. Okay. There is a back way to the museum, but I... But there's no point in going in it yet, because I can't do anything, because I don't have a cut yet. Last Janus would like to fight. Wow, that did nothing. Uh, so Misty is level 21. Okay. Man, I feel... Oh, man, I wonder how many people took the over in this game. Sixty-five to seven in your college football playoff championship game. Hey, no, 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 no critical hits from you. I think we might just make it to the Mount Moon Pokemon Center. Yeah, you should be able to survive one. Not 69, the game is ruined. They can get to 60. Actually, they could get to 69 with two safeties. It's not gonna happen, though. I'm mean. Hey, Janice, go fuck yourself. Shouldn't be staring if you don't want to battle. That's why the game is ruined. <laughs> oh, sorry, Janice. I am staring at you. Gotta go! She's not gonna like that I was staring at her ass, but uh, she's mad that I beat her anyway, so... Check my experience 
points here. Okay, uh, 10, 246, 174. Alright, so let's let Squirtle level up. Actually, what I should do... I should be able to get 10 experience points from that. Oh, final was 65 to 7. Yikes. Could have sworn Squirtle learned Water Gun at some point. Soon. Dead and buried in the ground. Dead and buried in the ground. I don't know what I'm singing anymore. Huh? Hey, I saw you were in the forest. Well, then why didn't you fight me then? I was scared. <laughs> bug catcher Colton wants the battle. Why do you not have a butter free, Colton? What is wrong with you? Four. Three, I'll take. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take it, I'll take it. How about this sort of perfect sleeper? I think I can get the grass type that I want. Um, by Nugget Bridge, I think. I'll have to double check that next time we play. So like I said earlier, um, I think Mario World tomorrow and uh, Link to the Past starting on Wednesday. Because you never need a reason to play Link to the Past. It's just that good. Oh, we haven't done Super Nintendo stuff in a while. Alright, that's a five hitter. That's what I wanted before. Catcher Cole, you beat me again. Oh, I fought him in the forest. Just because I don't remember who he is. Hi, I like shorts. They're delightfully comfy and easy to wear. Amen. Youngster Ben, who likes shorts, would like to fight. Just because I'm wearing shorts right now in 33 degree weather in New Jersey does not mean I don't like shorts. Lord Rattata's speed. That's great. Fury attack. Missed! Kyle, you're killing me here. That's what I'm talking about. Kill him! Ekans. No, no. Ekans may be one that I, that I use that I've never used before. Ekans has Intimidate? Oh, I don't like that. Ekans may be one I switch out when I get when I get one for Kyle. Do not poison my poison type. Thank you. There, that's a nice crit. Ah.
All right, defeated youngster Ben. You don't believe it. I'm the star of this game. You should believe it. I'm the star of the show. Are you a trainer? Let's get with it right away. Catcher Greg would like the battle. Oh, hard and damn it! I put my attacking moves on the one in the same column. He was the star of Monkey Spawn, though. <laughs> Two. <laughs> four? Aw, oh, four. Don't poison me. Don't do it. Thank you. And he's dead. Dead! Kakuna. No, I'm gonna leave Gr uh, Kyle the bee drill out there. Let's see if I can get lucky and get a lot of damage. Not lucky at all. Thank you, Kyle. Alright, we got five on that one. That'll help. GG, Kyle. Upside down happy face. So our next one for our party is either Sandshrew or Ekans. I'm thinking it's going to be Sandshrew. I think I'm naming it J Jeremy. I think I used a Jeremy in my blue playthrough. Named after Jeremy who used to watch the other channel, I think. First blue playthrough on here. I don't remember. If I can get them all to work, I'm gonna play them all on my channel at some point. But I'm not sure when. If I can get them all to work on the other channel. Never mind. Spit on this bug's face, Chuck. Chuchuki, spit on him. <laughs> we are going to be wrapping up in a little while. Um, we'll see how long it takes to get to the uh, Pokemon Center outside Mount Moon. Mount Moon's are not that far from where we are now. Catcher Greg. If I had new Pokemon, I would have won. Well, that's on you, Greg. Hey, you're not wearing shorts. What's wrong with you? I am wearing shorts. Youngster Calvin. What I wear is my my business. Uh oh.
course. Switch them out. Use Growl. Oh! Alright, it's fine. It's not a Nuzlocke. He's still alive. That's what I should have done. I didn't expect a level 14 Spiro. Oh, finally learned Water Gun. Alright, so Water Gun is 40 with 100. Bubble is 20, but lower speed. That yeah, bubble doesn't do me any good. I think that was the first speed drop I got on Bubble the whole time. Let me check level 12. Yeah, alright. Let's go heal. Never mind. Switch. Heal. Okay, let's go heal everybody. Uh, then we'll make our way back. We'll go through the crowd. There's only a few trainers left. Let me just save so I don't have to fight that damn Spiro again. That's the Spiro getting revenge on me for throwing him in the box. She find a Nidoran female from. Damn it, poison point. I just want to see something real quick. Oops. Okay. Uh, Flicks more damage on heavier foes. Has a high critical hit ratio. Fine, Maverick, you got this. I didn't realize, I just realized that Maverick was a girl. <laughs> it was a female Mankey. Don't matter, they're all strong in their own way. Defeated last Sally, be nice. I'll be nice. See that Pokemon? See that Pokemon Center down by the river? Yeah, you can meet me there in 20 minutes. Alright, let's see. That's a bug catcher. I'll battle you with the Pokemon I just caught. Bug catcher Jimmy! Jimmy! And I forgot I learned Water Gun. That'll help. Oh, that'll help a lot. I don't remember Squirtle learning Water Gun at level 13. It feels so far away. That's a crit. He's dead. 
uh, yeah, you know what, I will leave you in. Spit on him again! Yeah. I believe, till uh, evolution for Squirtle. Alright, let's put Maverick in the lead spot. You know what? Let's put Kyle in the lead spot for now. Let's fight that girl eventually. Shishpiro. It is Shishpiro. Oh shit, it's a Spiro. Do some heavy damage to him, Kyle. Son of a... Every time I ask Kyle to do anything. a Jigglypuff fight. Eek! Did you touch me? No, you walked over and talked to me. Last Robin wants to fight. Send out Jigglypuff. I don't think I've ever used a Jigglypuff. Oh, cute charm. Oh, damn it. Apparently, Kyle fought through the cute charm. Oh, I disabled my fury attack. Oh no! Oh, damn it! Come on, Kyle, we're trying to kill this thing. You're a bug, she's a balloon, it'll never work! Defeated the last Robin. That's it? That is it. Rule 4 is at the foot of Mount Moon. That's because you touched me. I think we're... Oh, we're here. That's not true. This guy says... Oh, wow, that's the boulder badge you got from Brock, didn't you? Brock's cool. He's not just... He's not just tough. People like and respect him. I want to become a gym leader like him. She said... Or he says... I think that's a girl. Ow! I tripped over Rocky Pokemon. Geodude! So this is Mount Moon. Um, we'll heal, talk to the people in the Pokemon Center, and then we'll see if we can catch a Pokemon or two in each patch of grass. Okay, set six Pokeballs in my belt. Yeah, that'll do it. At most, you can have six. We're gonna talk to that guy in a second. Him rocket attacks the ruined citizens. Not a day goes by without two rockets being in the news. Sometimes you'll have too many Pokemon. Hello there, laddie! Have I got the deal just for you? I'll let you have a secret Pokemon, a Magikarp, for just 500 Poke Dollars. So you'll buy it, right? No. 
No? You say no? I'm not only doing this as a favor to you. I was gonna do it as an Italian accent, but I changed my mind. I don't know why I went Scottish or Irish there, but I did. You don't like it? Too bad. All right, so let's see this grass. Let's see what we can find here. Hey, look, it's a manky. Oh, nice crit. That's what we're talking about. Alright, Marv, go out there. Let's see if we can find something that we don't have yet. I think you can find Ekans in this grass. Nope, that's a Pidgey. That is a Pidgey. That is a Pidgey again. Damn you, Pidgey! That's a Spiro. Not a Pidgey. Can't get mad at him. It's not a Pidgey. Smack that Pidgey in the face. Spiro. Can I kill you with a karate chop? I can. Might have to look at other patch of grass. Jigglypuff. Alright, we'll catch a Jigglypuff. Level 3. What do you think? We think we'll kill it? Let's see. We killed it. Hey, Nidoran female. Try and catch this one. Did we kill it? Did not kill it. What to name the female Nidoran? Hey, we're probably not gonna use it, but I got a, but I got a name for it. Female Nidoran's named is Axeman. <laughs> Cause why not? Let me go heal, let me deposit. And the Pokemon will probably never use. But I'm still nicknaming them after people watching. I'd double probably be the next one if I decide to name it anything. Anybody anything? Alright, so then we're gonna go down to the other patch of grass. See if we can go here for my licensing department in the morning. <laughs> uh, I I have access to the intellectual property because you're in the public domain, Axeman, so I can name it after your likeness. All right, so let's see if we can find an Ekans or a Nid or a uh, Jigglypuff. This use is not fair. <laughs> this is fair. Are you saying that you are not a Nidoran female? Is that what you're telling me? I'm getting from the impression that you are not a Nidoran female. I was told that Maverick is a Mankey, Chichuki is a Squirtle, and Kyle is a Beedrill. I don't know where these mixed signals are coming from. Alright, Jigglypuff. Level 5. I wonder if we'll... Scratch. 
try not to kill it. Perfect. Oh, what are you what are you doing? You're not supposed to have berries. You don't even have karate chop. You have double kick. Maybe. Maverick stayed awake. That's my Maverick! What if I get away with using Poison Sting on it? Probably. I can't wait to see myself poison it. I'm gonna use it, but I won't. But now that I, now that I found where I can catch it, we got it. I'm gonna have to run back and get more Pokeballs. Jigglypuff so data was added to the Pokedex. When its huge eyes waver, it sings a mysterious, soothing melody that lulls its enemies to sleep. Yeah, I, I have a nickname for this. Mika. Mika is a follower of mine on Twitter. That's what I'll do when I play the games on YouTube for my channel. I'll tweet out, like, oh, uh, Pokemon, my followers, Pokemon nicknames, nicknames of Pokemon that you'd want to be. Alright, so 13, let's see. It's 205. Okay, let's, this is what we'll do. We'll go in this patch of grass, we'll see what we can find. Because I'm not using any trade evolution, guys, so. Because I can't trade them. So we find anything good, we'll catch, and if not, we won't. It's that simple. But we are going to be wrapping up in a few minutes. Uh, I just want to get this manky up to level 14. At least we can one-hit these Pidgeys and Spearows now. I'm waiting for that one to not get one hit and then, like, kill me. There's that Nidoran female again. I was trying to avoid that. Okay, so every time it 
the screen flashes. In the older games, you lose health from poison damage. In the newer games, you don't lose health from poison damage. I want to get one more fight in, because that should be enough to level them up. Knew it was going to be Nidoran female again, so I'm leaving. Let's see if I can fight one more and not be a Nidoran female. Guarantee the next like, three are going to be Nidoran females. Nope. It's another Maverick, the Mankey! Kick him. Good enough to level up. Let's go buy some back to Pewter City, buy some more Pokeballs. Oops, sorry, I thought there was patch of grass down there. We'll go back to Pewter City. We'll buy some Pokeballs. We'll make our way back to the entrance of Mount Moon. I said eight, and I went with seven. Seven is fine. Do I have anything that I can sell yet? Nope. All right, so we have nine Pokeballs now. Let us fly back to Mount Moon. I'll give the team recap when we get to the Pokemon Center outside of Mount Moon. Mount Moon ahead. Alright, so let's just heal up one more time. We'll save. I'll give the Poke Team recap of our catches for tonight and our three Pokemon in our party. I'll play some nice Shack Pets advertisement, and then that'll be the end of the episode. If you were new to the channel, make sure to give us a follow. If you want to subscribe? We'd love that as well. Steve Tendo Show will be back tomorrow at 8 o'clock Eastern Time um, with either Super Mario World or Legend of Zelda A Link to the Past. I think it's going to be Super Mario World tomorrow and then Mar and then uh, Legend of Zelda on Wednesday. Alright, so here's our team recap. See you soon, Mayof. Alright, so here's our team recap. Uh, guys, we caught, we caught Spiro, the Spiro, because I didn't nickname him, Chuck the Pikachu, Axeman, the Nidoran female. Mika, the Jigglypuff. That is someone that follows me on Twitch. On Twitter, you should do the same. Uh, at TomsST. Okay, so here is the rest of the team. Maverick, the Mankey, level 14. With Scratch, Leer, Low Kick, Cry Chop. Kyle, the Beedrill. Poison Sting, String Shot, Harden, and Fury Attack. And Chichuki, the Squirtle. With Tackle, Tail Whip, Water Gun, and Withdraw. We have one Gym Badge under our belt uh, but don't go anywhere yet you know what we do when we end these things just let me get to a good spot to do that pause it do that okay let me throw this up there bam
All right, folks, that's going to do it for me. If you read the chat, uh, you'll see Mario World tomorrow night at 8 o'clock Eastern Time. My name is Steve. We hope to see you in the next one. Later.